Well, hello, little boy. Are you excited to wake up? Hello. Hello. Ooh. Are you any attention? I got Pet him. So you can't go near this plant. It wants to attach itself to you. All the burrs here. Careful, Arthur. I don't want to pick burrs out of you. Oh, here's some snow evidence. Look at that. That's pretty. There's not much left of the snow that happened yesterday. I was hoping to see some on some of these trees, make it really be Christmassy, and that would have been really pretty, but I guess not. But it's on the ground a little bit, in some areas, I guess, more than others. So I should really use my common sense more. I thought I could keep Arthur away from the burrs. I couldn't. I don't know, he just goes right to them, and then they attach it. Him and now he's got burrs on him and it's just like ah why did I come this way I came this way cuz Arthur likes being here whoa and he likes to kick up ground and grass we're not gonna go down that path this time Arthur oh we won't film that but yeah no Arthur likes being in this area cuz it's it's kind of secluded and it's got lots of smells and it's nice. <sighs> and it's it's different from like sidewalks. So he likes it here. And maybe he just likes getting burrs covered in his body and then he can watch me struggle as I take them out. So I've been sitting here for the last like four hours, well maybe not four hours, I've been sitting here for the last two hours, I'm going to say two hours, uh, working on our marketing project and uh, our project is on firkin pubs and uh, one thing that we're really focused on, at least our part of the group assignment, is um, doing our SWOT analysis, which is strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats, and looking at competition. And the oh, problem with that so hungry. <laughs> is, like, we're constantly looking at, like, just th throughout the internet, looking at all these different restaurants, like, web pages and everything, and looking at their menu selection, and, oh, I'm just looking at pages and pages and pages of, like, chicken wings and ribs and poutine and chicken fingers and burgers and clubs and oh it's just it's very painful and I'm getting very very hungry another thing is that because we got to write about the competition we got to write about like strengths and weaknesses and we're gonna for our project we're, we're claiming that we want to place a firkin pub in Uxbridge um, and so looking at the competition in Uxbridge, we came up with this one place called Colonel McGrady's Pub and Grill. And just looking at their website, I've just been like, holy canoodle, that place looks delicious. Amazing. Yeah. Like, if I had to choose between that place and Firkin, Firkin I would choose that place at least. Because I've been to Firkin's before. I've never been to this place. And it looks good. It looks and sounds good. And Maybe we'll go one it's day. awesome. Because I'm like writing up about their strengths. And I'm like, and this. And this is a strength. And this is a strength. And this is a strength. And I was like, what are their weaknesses? Hmm. <laughs> and I couldn't think of any. I put some stuff down. Just of like, oh, they're slightly higher priced. Or I don't know, whatever. Stuff that isn't 
really important. Uh, but yeah. Are they doing too many things and they're stretched too thin? Mm, you could argue that, yeah. but probably not. Probably not. I don't know. You could argue that they should put less focus into their Twitter and more focus into their menu. Kitchen. <laughs> into their kitchen, yeah. But I don't know because I haven't been there, so I don't know if the food's actually bad. Everything I've read says it's really good, so yeah. I don't know. So I'm just getting really hungry. I mean, my mom is going to make us dinner, but I want to eat now. Me too. At least we're going to eat earlier than last night. <laughs> it's funny, last night my mom was just like, hey, you guys should come over for dinner and we'll have food probably at like 6, maybe 7. We ate at like 8.30. <laughs> yeah. Just kind of kept getting pushed back and back, which was fine, but we had prepared for 8.30. I mean, we had prepared for eating at like 6.30. We hadn't prepared for eating at 8.30. Safe to say, once we got our food, it was gone. It was gone. We had pierogies last night. That was pretty good. And tonight I think we're having ribs, like chicken and ribs. I think so. So that's good because that's what I've been staring at for the last forever. So, how motivated do you feel to work right now? Very little. Very little. What would you rather be doing? Playing Skyrim. <laughs> yes. <sighs> We've gotten back into Skyrim. I Lydia's did it. playing. I have a character. I play Skyrim. Yep. Fun. Yeah, Lydia. And then I shoved the controller <laughs> Yeah, you're like, I want to walk all the way over there, the other side of the map. Can you do Here that, Here you go. <laughs> I was like, okay, fine. But yeah, so we've gotten back into Skyrim, starting a new game. Lydia created a female Khajiit, which Yay. is which is like a cat person. What's your character's name? Lydia? No, it's not Lydia. It's Lyra. Yes. That's what it is. Lyra. So yeah. We're kicking butt. I didn't butt. want to be called Lydia too, because there's, there's a Lydia. Lydia there's a character game. named Lydia in the game who's a, kind of annoying. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so that's really fun, and we're trying not to play that right now, although we really, really want well, to. Well, we played, and then we're like, we're gonna stop. We're gonna do work, and we've done work, so now we can play again, and then maybe, maybe later. A little bit. To, yeah. Yay. Yeah. Yeah. I think so. I think so too, and I still have yet. To watch the Doctor Who special, but I will. I'm hoping to watch that tonight. We'll see, though. It depends on how much work I get done. So, hey, oh yeah, hey, there's a Christmas tree. <laughs> I know Arthur. Arthur wants to be known. Yeah. Yummy food. Cut the ribs. Just have the whole thing. It's perfect. <laughs> this is a lovely looking meal. Oh yeah. So much so we got dressed up. Yeah, nice. <laughs> you did put a shirt on. <laughs> I was told to look nice, so I look nice. If I button up, I can look nice. Way to copy me. Jeez. I had this on before you had your shirt on. Well, Bye. but that's mine. Yeah, so. <laughs> that doesn't mean anything anymore. Alright. Oh, I want to eat. <laughs> Hello. Your glasses are a little, uh, fogged over. <laughs> it's really cold outside. Uh, apparently. It's winter. You took Arthur for a walk. Thank I you. I did. You're yeah. welcome. That was nice. Arthur! I was gone forever. You really were. We went on a long walk. So did I. Did you now? In, in the game. In the game? Yeah. We went around and then we didn't stop at the park, we went through the park because I don't like the path there because it's really dark and scary. Yeah. So we went through the field area because even the path going that way was dark, too dark. Yeah. But the field had just enough light so I could see and I could drop kick anybody who got close enough. But I, I would see them coming. Pretty much. Pretty much. I'm a little paranoid. Oh. Oh, yeah. Did you move your car? Yes. Spending the night. Yes. Feel like going home? Hi. So you might as well stay here. There's a happy puppy looking at me. <laughs> Mwah. Yeah, and then we came back. But yeah, we went a long way. Good. Because I wanted him to get a nice walk in. Good. Does that mean I don't have to take him for a walk later? Um, 
Not a long one, if anything. Yeah. Because he's peed out. He's been, he's been fake peeing uh. for like five minutes, and he pooed. Ew. Ew again. Gross. Our turn. You're gross. And the only thing that's cold is my legs. Perfect. All right, let's get back to work. Okay. You work. I'll play Skyrim. All right. Just got back from taking Arthur for his final stroll. Now it's time to go to bed. Someone's already asleep. <laughs> it's been a long day. Alright. Time to go to bed. Good night.